I just, I just want to say on behalf of all the actors that we want to thank our reps, and I forgot to thank my manager of 14 years, Susan, by Mel. Susan, I love you so much. Thank you for everything. Just had to say that. Okay, I, I haven't forgotten to thank anyone because I haven't started yet, um, but I will forget millions of people. It, is, um, it was such a huge project, this, and there are a lot of people to thank. Um, but the first thing I would love to say is that this room has made some amazing films and some amazing TV shows this year, and I think we should... Well, I'd like to congratulate everybody here because it's been incredible. Um, and for those films to be making money and financed by studios, I think there's a great future for the film business now, which is fantastic. Um, anyway, I want to thank Tom Hooper, without whom this film would have been made. I want to thank our amazing cast, um, who, I mean, the ensemble in this film is just absolute genius. I want to thank Claude Michel Schoenberg, Alain Boublil, Herbie Kretzmer, who created this... Yeah, who created this show. Jeez, we've got to wrap up already. Um, Cameron McIntosh, Deborah, Tim, you know, everyone. Universal, Brian and Steve at Comcast, thank you all. And thank you to the Hollywood Foreign Press Association for recognizing the passion and love that went into this film. Thank you very much. is so good looking he makes young George Clooney look like garbage please welcome middle-aged George Clooney I would like to congratulate Ben Affleck on his win all right here are the nominees for best actress in a motion picture drama Jessica Chastain, Zero Dark Thirty. Marion Cotillard, Rust and Bone. Helen Mirren, Hitchcock. Naomi Watts, The Impossible. And Rachel Weisz, The Deep Blue Sea. And the award goes to Jessica Chastain, Zero Dark Thirty. Thank you so much to the Hollywood Foreign Press Association for this award. I've wanted to be an, an actor since I was a little girl, and I've worked for a really long time. I've auditioned and struggled and fought and been on the sidelines for years. And to be here now in this moment, it's a beautiful feeling to receive this encouragement and support, and thank you so much. I <laughs> have, okay. <laughs> I would not be here uh, without my amazing team, Paul, Jack, Hilda, Nicole, Steve. Thank you. Uh, thank you to our amazing crew, our incredible cast, Jason Clark, thank you. To my dear friend, Megan Ellison, uh, Sony, the great, great Amy Pascal for protecting our film, Mark Bull for writing a strong, capable, independent woman that stands on her own, and to Catherine Bigelow, my director. I can't help but compare my character of Maya to you, to powerful, fearless women that allow their expert work to stand before them. You've said that filmmaking for you is not about breaking gender roles, but when you make a film that allows your character to disobey the conventions of Hollywood, you've done more for women in cinema than you can take credit for. And last but definitely not least, I have to thank my grandmother for um, teaching me to always believe in my dreams, and this is an absolute dream come true. Thank you so much. Now, Mer Meryl Streep was supposed to be presenting this award, but she's under the weather, so I get to keep going. The nominees for Best Actor in a Motion Picture Drama are... Daniel Day-Lewis, Lincoln. 
Richard Gere, arbitrage. John Hawks, the session. Joaquin Phoenix, the master. And Denzel Washington, flight. And the award goes to Daniel Day-Lewis. Are you sure there's room for another ex-president on this stage? Well, if you thought that was showing off, uh, Her Majesty the Queen of England is about to parachute in in a couple of minutes to uh, make a last-minute pitch for Skyfall. Um, <clears throat> my sincerest thanks to the Hollywood For Foreign Press Association for this lovely thing. Um, if I had this on a timeshare uh, basis uh, uh, w with my wonderful gifted colleagues, I, I, I might just hope to keep it for one day in the year and I'd be happy with that, but I'll take good care of this. Um, to my fellow nominees, boys and girls, uh, such beautiful performances this, this year, I, I'm very proud to be one amongst you. Um, when I go to work, Rebecca opens a window for me and I jump out into the night and, and hunt and scavenge and at the end of it I come back uh, with whatever it is and drop it like a mouse at her feet and hope so much that she'll think I've done a good thing. <laughs> Tony Kushner, uh, every day I have to live without the immeasurable wealth of your language which reminds me every day of the impoverishment of my own. And Steven Spielberg, a di director, a humble master with a quicksilver imagination, as a friend, loving and kind, and by your generosity, a partner, You've given me an experience that I will treasure till the end of my life. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. And now, three-time Golden Globe winner, Julia Roberts. Best motion picture drama. Once again, here are the nominees. Argo. Django Unchained. Life of Pi. Lincoln. Zero Dark Thirty. And the Golden Globe goes to Argo. Coming to the stage, producers George Clooney and Grant Hesloff, and accepting the Golden Globe for Argo is star, director, producer, Ben Affleck. Thank you. Wow. Uh, on behalf of the uh, whole cast and crew, I want to thank the Hollywood Foreign Press for this. Um, thank you. Uh, Victor Garber, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, ben, Ben's thanked a lot of people. I want to thank all the folks at Warner Brothers. They've, they've supported us through this whole thing, and they've been amazing, and thank you guys very much. Um, we want to thank Ben Affleck. Our fearless leader. And a producer too. And he's also a producer. Um, 
I want to thank um, all the thousands of uh, people that work in our diplomatic services that are putting their lives in the line every day of the week. This is for them. We want to thank the folks in the clandestine services who don't always get the credit that they deserve, but they do a lot of great work, and thank you to them as well. I'm getting the wrap-up, so um, thank you, everybody. Thank you very much. And love to my wife, Lisa, and my kids, Maya and Olivia. The nomination ballot is mailed to all eligible members of the Hollywood Foreign Press Association who choose up to five nominees in each category. On the final ballot, the same members vote for one nominee in each category. Information concerning the final results is known only to the accounting firm of Ernst & Young LLP prior to tonight's opening of the sealed envelopes. Tonight's Golden Globe theme was composed by international music artist Yoshiki. This is Sean Parr for the 70th Annual Golden Globe Awards.